Boom's lunches. Before we begin, I just got one little thing to say. No, nothing too important, but check this out. Yeah, that's right. I finally got merch. Shem, um, get the Looms lunch. You, you see here, I uh, forgot to add the S because um, I ran out of space. Yeah, unlucky. But that's all right. You can get it at the link below here. I'm, I'm using my arms. I'm not used to using the camera, so I don't know if I got everything at the right angle. But that's the way with things, isn't it? Tonight on Loom's Lunches, we got this specialty Italian dish, bruz. It's beautiful. It's not pre-purchased. -pre Just ignore that packaging. It's got uh, purple things. I'm really not sure what is in it. I, I wasn't really paying attention. All I saw was the good old Woolies, Woolies yellow discount thing. And I was like, yeah, let's buy that. Heck yeah. And I bought it. Just like, you know, flick, it, flick of the fingers purchase. Self-serve checkout and all that. <laughs> yeah. Karen took the kids. Now that the, now that the, now the dessert is cooking, let's go for our main course. Tonight on Loom's Lunches, I'm going to be enjoying one of the most popular dishes in the Western world. Murdoch propaganda, also known in this country as Sky News, might also be called Fox News or the Australian, but this is a very tasty dish, you see. And we're going to enjoy that because, uh, I mean, I was going to eat the pizza at the same time, but it's, it's going to still be a little bit of a while away, eh? You got this person here who I'm pretty sure is uh she's proud in her new body and then you got another lady who I don't really have anything to say about her. Just that she sometimes accidentally interrupts the other lady and I I just think I just think that's a little bit rude, Jesse. Yeah, just a little bit rude. Well, now now you're talking about this fella named Daniel Andrews. Who's that? Is this some kind of, um, is this a documentary about a uh, Nazi or something? I, I can't figure it out, can I? They're just giving me a lot of random statistics about some sort of dictator. And, and that lady who keeps interrupting is talking again. I, I don't know what's going on. What is this? I, I just want to eat my pizza. <coughs> Finally, she's done. Me beautiful pizza. You can't see because it's uh, dark. Yeah, my beautiful pizza. Look at that. Delicious. Time to review it. Better than Red Rooster and Rookingham, I tell you. Let's try this peri peri chicken pizza. Almost said a different P word then, but I won't tell you what one. <laughs> Mmm, delicious. It's too hot. I can't eat it yet. So it's just going to sit here being crunchy and unedible. Such is life, I suppose. <laughs> Such is life. Put myself in a bit of a predicament, you see. Unfortunately, I cannot move from my current seating position. And uh, I have a bit of a problem with the fact that I, I'm watching the most brain dead stuff on TV. Pretty, uh, pretty in a conundrum, eh? I don't think I'm going to survive. I think this is going to be the last Looms lunches. Till my wife. She's a bitch for leaving me. And tell little Timmy, my kid, that I liked him more than David. David was a little bitch. I punched him once and he cried. I mean, he was seven, but still. Fuck the film in the first bite. Because I was watching 
the news turns out old mate Donnie's recovered from the COVID. Good for him, eh? I mean, I think he's a bit silly, but that's America for you, I guess. They're all a bit silly over there. That's a fair slice, just going to cut it in half. Yeah. This peri peri chicken pizza is uh, it's a pizza work, eh? Now they're talking to me at Boris. Who the hell names your child Boris? What the hell does that name even mean? It makes me think of a friend of mine in primary school. Like, he just looks like him, you know? He just kind of looks like someone you know from a long, long time ago. I'm going to do my conclusive review, even though I'm not completely done yet. Because I feel the television is sapping me of so much of my cheese. Is that what the gooks say? Cheese, the Chinese. It, it's just, it, it's getting rid of all my energy. I don't have any left. I feel like a sack of potatoes right now from the from the drone and that's coming from the television. I legitimately feel like going to sleep. I feel like uh, me trying to go to sleep by watching someone play Oxygen Not Included with a very soothing voice. I'm, I'm going to have to rate the pizza at a solid... Honestly, I haven't eaten enough of it to give it a full review, but I rate the Murdoch propaganda at a solid 11 out of 10. Daniel Andrews is and Daniel Andrews is bad, and um, Scott Morrison's doing a good job. Please release me from my mental prison. I beg of you. This has been Loom's lunches.